let's understand what is an increasing function okay so let's uh, understand uh, what is an increasing function by looking at some examples right we will see some examples of an increasing function also some examples of function which are not increasing okay so okay so let's look at this function is this an increasing function yes this is an increasing function okay now let's look at this function f dash okay f prime uh, which is also from the domain 1 2 3 to the codomain 1 2 3 4 5 this is a function defined okay is this an increasing function no this is not an increasing function let's understand why this is not an increasing function okay so here we know that of course in the domain if you see 1 is less than 2 right but f prime of 1 is not less than or equal to f prime of 2 in fact f prime of 1 is actually greater than f prime of 2 here when 1 is less than 2 okay that should not happen that's why this function is not an increasing function see okay so let it be uh, any domain okay so f from a domain set to a codomain set right so that's how a function is usually okay and uh, now if you take any two elements x y belonging to the domain if x is less than y right it it should be the case that f of x should be less than or equal to f of y for all x y belonging to the domain okay this should be the case this should be defined only if then we say that f is increasing function increasing function this this case should happen for any two values x and y belonging to the domain whenever x is less than y it should be the case that f of x should be less than or equal to f of y in fact if for all pair x comma y belonging to the domain when x is less than y if and only if f of x is less than f of y this is the case for strictly increasing okay in this case there is no equal to okay so when x is less than y f of x should be definitely less than f of y for all x comma y belonging to the domain okay then we say that it is strictly increasing function otherwise when x is less than y f of x is if f of x is less than or equal to f of y then we say that it is an increasing function okay now what we are going to do is counting the number of increasing functions from 1 2 3 to 1 2 3 4 5 